Hey everyone, it's Suzanne. I'm back with another video and this video is a little haul that I picked up from FOMO Lacquer. FOMO Lacquer was doing a charity duo um, for a friend of the owner's daughter and 100% of the profits were going to be donated to help this little girl who's going through some health issues. And um, so I wound up picking up those two polishes because I thought they're beautiful the polishes are beautiful and it's a beautiful cause you know a wonderful cause and you know if you can help support it um you know why not so before I show you those two polishes let me show you what's on my nails so first up what's on my nails is a polish from chameleon nails on my index finger and it is called orca and it's just a black jelly with white matte glitters really really fun fun polish and then what's on my other nails is this polish from Orly, and this is Mui Caliente, and I wound up finding this at TJ Maxx. Um, I think they're like four four ninety nine, so five dollars at TJ Maxx. If you like these type of colors and you see this at your local TJ Maxx and you don't own it, you need to get it because it's good. It's good. I don't even like these type of base colors really myself, but they're they're you know. <clears throat> I don't know. It's just good. Like I said, it's not really my favorite base color in the world, but I had heard people talk about it and then I saw it at my TJ Maxx and I was like, I know people have raved about this polish. So I'm like, let me get it. And I understand why it is good. So like I said, these were two polishes um, that were going, like I said, 100% of the profits are going to help this little girl. So the first one is called, I say it Braley, but I've heard other people say it Breely. But I say it Braley, Braley's Journey. And this is a bold red shade with gorgeous shimmer and subtle hollow sparkle. This is really, really pretty. This would be um, a fun Christmas polish around Christmas time. I mean, I would wear it anytime, but this definitely gives me like um, Christmassy uh, vibes or like Wizard of the. Oh my, the woo! Like I just said, I'm not a red base person. This is nice. This is nice. I might only do one coat. Look how, I guess I'll do a second coat, but it's so, so nice. Like it's a, a one coater. It's opaque. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh. This is really, really, it definitely is giving me like, um, Wizard of the Oz, like Dorothy's shoes, her little, uh, red uh glittered i was getting ready to say sapphire but sapphire's blue her little red uh i guess garnet her little red uh sparkly glittery shoes that's exactly what this polish looks like if you are a red person at the time of me filming this there are still these polishes are still on her website so you could still pick them up but if you're a red person you're gonna love that one so this one is Braley's Journey. And then the next one is called, look at this one. This is called Rainbow of Hope. And this is described as a show-stopping topper full of holographic glitters in every color of the rainbow. Really, really pretty. This would be stunning on that red. I'm not going to swatch it on that red because we just swatched that red. So it's probably nowhere near dry so i'm going to swatch it alone just to give you um you know what it would look like alone you get a ton of glitters in that first coat i'm going to swatch it over i'll swatch it over a couple of these colors that are already here so here's what it's going to look like on green oh my gosh this is this this would look good on any color it's just one of those toppers that it doesn't matter the color you know you pick the color put this on it's going to change the way the polish looks um, I'm going to do it on all these colors I might want to put it on the red by the time we get done so we can just see it but this is a type of topper you pick the color it's going to look amazing on any color you wear it on it's going to be so fun look at it on this yellow so fun that would be so fun on the nails um here's another lighter yellow we'll, we'll just like i said we'll just do all these nails real fast no big no biggie really really fun really cute giving me like making me think of a banana split with this one i don't know why because banana split doesn't have all these colors but that's what it's making me think of so cute this topper's just you know it's just one of those like 
if you were like, oh, I don't want to buy a whole lot of toppers, but I want to have a topper, this is one you could have in your arsenal and you could pull out. Because look, it just would look good on any color. It wouldn't matter what color it was. We're going to put it on this darker um, orange. It's, it's like a traffic cone orange. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I am going to attempt to put it on this red. I don't know if the reds had time to dry. So this might uh, mess up the red. But we're going to find out. Because I saw someone. Yeah, it's dry enough for it to take it. I saw someone wearing this. Um, these two together. Swatched it and showed it. And it was just so stunning on the red. But look at this topper. Here it is alone in one coat. We'll, we'll go in and do a second coat of it um, by itself. Uh, now, for me personally, I wouldn't do two coats of this unless I was going to wear it alone and just have a nail line showing. Because you can do that with your toppers. I've done it before. Um, but you have to be willing to show a nail line because you're not going to get opacity with a topper like this or any most of the toppers you're not going to get opacity with. But here's what it looks like alone in two coats. Um, I would probably just wear it over a color in one coat because it just looks stunning on all these colors. Really, really pretty on the red. But every one of these colors, really, really pretty, really pretty polish. Um, so again, this one was Rainbow of Hope. Just a fun, fun topper. So these are the two polishes that I picked up from FOMO Lacquer. If you haven't tried FOMO Lacquer, um, you really should. It's it's a good brand. It, the polishes have all been amazing. And um, these polishes here, like I said, 100% of the profits. Like you don't normally see that. You usually just see like, you know, a couple dollars here, a couple dollars there, which is amazing. And when anybody gives anything to charity, but for 100% of the profits, that's a lot. Um, that's very generous. But these polishes are beautiful. Like I said, I believe they're still on the website. So if there's something you would be into or if you just want to try to help out the cause, you could go uh, purchase them and support them. But they are really pretty. If you have any other small brands that um, you know about, like smaller indie brands, I would love to hear about those too. Because I'm always into, you know, trying to help support some of the smaller brands so they can become the bigger indie brands. Um, let me know down below because I would love to look them up and go check out what they have. If you like nail con content like this, please consider subscribing to my channel. I do nail videos all the time. And I also do monthly giveaways of nail polish to subscribers. I hope everyone has a great day. Remember, keep polishing. Bye.